if there's an Israeli election coming up soon, so that pushes so-called negotiations further away. I know there's no crystal ball, but tell us about you know, what's happening. Well, I think the, if, if the Arab Spring is about uh, the fragmentation of the Arab state and the Islamization, the Palestinians were the pioneers in this process. Uh, the Hamas uh, won elections in 2006. In 2007, they took over Gaza, fragmenting the Palestinian uh, territories, Palestinian PA. Um, I think that there is a divorce between Abbas and you know, the Fatah and, and PA. Uh, Abbas is basically governing because he's sitting on Israeli bayonets in the West Bank, because we are mowing the grass <laughs> in, in you know, taking West care of, of, of the Hamas guys. Um, and uh, Abbas doesn't need negotiations. I think he made a clear uh, choice that he doesn't want negotiations. He adopted the unilateral approach and basically doesn't pay a price for it because uh, uh, you know, the money is flowing. Uh, so even Obama just decided against uh, a, gov a congressional decision to, to send additional $160 million to the Palestinians. So uh, they pay no price for not uh, having negotiations with Israel. Uh, I'm not sure we want them to pay a price, a too high price, because we don't want hungry neighbors. Uh, and uh, Ramallah is doing well. You know, I don't, I don't know how many of you have been to Ramallah. Mm. Ramallah is, uh, you know, it's not under occupation, you know, no, not so terrible life, uh, as well as other uh, Palestinian cities. Uh, even uh, in Gaza, they are doing better. They are getting money from here and there. Uh, and uh, Abbas is paying for... Uh, uh, civil servants in, uh, in, in Gaza that do nothing, but he's paying their salaries. It's not a bad arrangement. Um, so um, the Palestinians are... Uh, is that enough to lead to peace, or is that just... Uh, excuse me? I mean, if, if the Palestinians are doing well in their home, yeah. own personal lives, is that enough to sort of stop the desire for uh, conflict or to uh, be a sort of a solution to the issue? Uh, not, no, but uh, you know, if uh, I think most people are not political, and what do they want? They want a nice life, they want to send their children to school, and to, and to have a very bourgeois type of, uh, of life. Uh, so, uh, if uh, this can be done, uh, you know, as a stopgap measure, that's, that's okay. You know. The education system there is not helpful in promoting peace, uh, and uh, but uh, the status quo is better. Yes. Yes. This is something uh, we should not, uh, you know, belittle. Uh, if someday is going to pay, uh, fine. And uh, I think the status quo will, will continue.